the read and the write nodes read and write files to disk and they show us the dialog box, the standard Nuke dialog box for reading and writing files. Slightly different, well considerably different to the standard system dialog box. Single click to open folders. Folders are slightly more uh, heavy in the in their their bold they mark up bold their names. Single click to open. You can also filter for sequences. That's an image sequence there. And if I want to save another image sequence, I can do image underscore hash 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 dot tiff. The number of hashes I put in here in this instance denote the number of numerals that will be saved in the uh, that would uh, mark the range of the tiffs and save. And one useful one use for these things is if we all if we if in our project settings we have set our default proxy size we can here set our path for a proxy and then when we render when we are in render mode there select that once select render and it will render out your proxies for you which is quite nice so if you want a, a sort of an easy cheap way of rendering out your proxies just place a right node beneath it select where your proxies are going to go and then select your right node and render render selected and you've got to do all of this whilst your proxy button there has been pressed okay